shit overheated. What actually is it? HQ Kingsley. I built it years ago and then we yeah. pulled the engine out and mucked around and it's just sat in the shed. Uh, I had a 454. Oh, the engine wasn't in it when it burned out. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. So 454, ton around. Yeah. Yeah, Merlin heads. And How long you had it for? Uh, not too long. I think I got it when I was about 22. Jeez, so, bro, that's devastating, man. It took have Yeah. A few years. But yeah, I'll know oh, things. The end of the day, it's only a car. At least you weren't in They it. made thousands of them. True. It's not like there's a shortage. Oh, demolition dude, which is what I was going to do with this one. Going to slap a six cylinder back in it. Get box because I've got a spare one. And I was going to demo do a bit. Uh, and what's your plan now? Sell whatever cuts come off and um, yeah. next week we'll go scrapping. Even if there's stuff on it, you reckon it's still good, you'll send it to the scrapping. I'll oh, just scrap what's left. Will you? Yeah. Nah, no, you can't do that, bro. Uh, jump in there, what? Fuck, is it safe in here? Yeah, fuck <laughs> yeah. Roof's pulled down. Roof's pretty naked, eh? So that was yeah. from the heat that caused that to... Yeah, and there's just shit stacked on it. But if you actually flipped it over and heat shrunk it out and pushed it, probably yeah. most of it would come out. Yeah. No recovering anything interior? No, all the interior was redone. It all had, um, had the left bucket seats in the front. Okay, I'm just going to leave this one for you guys in the comments to say what you think. All I'll say is that for me, I think that maybe the fire was a better outcome than had he demolition derbied it because I got the floor cut out of it and I've been chasing this part for ages and uh, no, I did not start that fire so I could get this. It is interesting that for me to get the piece I wanted, somebody else's car had to catch on fire. Look forward to hearing what your thoughts are on this one. Hit that like button. Cheers for watching.